Right now, it's a basic need. People in Wellington want fresh food. See what the neighborhood grocery store looks like right now, shelves sitting empty. It's the latest town in food limbo as 7 News continues to investigate this problem at Bella's Markets across our state. And Jacqueline Allen live in Wellington tonight. Jacqueline, the owner of those stores, promised answers tonight. Right, you know, this meeting just got out in the last few minutes. Sam Mancini, the owner, has refused our request for an interview, but he was supposed to come here tonight to speak to people frustrated about all those empty shelves at their grocery store. We wanted to get some answers, too, but he never showed up. The Stevens Family Kitchen is just four blocks from the Bella's Market in Wellington, where the sign may say shop local, but what's inside tells a different story. Our hidden camera shows empty shelves, limited produce, and no toilet paper at all. I would much rather go four blocks than 20 miles round trip to do my shopping. It's forced us to not be able to when we can't get a roll of toilet paper. We found similar stories at Bella's Markets in Akron, Haxton, Wiggins, and Lyman. And look at this new cell phone video from a viewer in Walden. The Bella's there is bare. They have to drive 60 miles one way to get fresh food. Denver businessman Sam Mancini owns all of these grocery stores. His company declared bankruptcy in 2012 and has been in legal battles ever since. In a statement telling 7 News, that makes it difficult to invest in the stores. In Wellington tonight, they don't care about the legal battles. They want answers. A frustrated crowd turned out to hear Mancini speak at this town board meeting, but he was a no-show. And people who've had enough are tired of feeling their food is being held hot. Hostage. It's hurting this entire town. It needs to be solved. It needs to be solved now. Now, the Wellington mayor says there are other companies willing to bring in a grocery store here. He says Mancini told him tonight that he hopes to have his problems addressed by the end of the month, and if he doesn't, he'll do something different. The mayor said he asked Mancini if that means another operator could come in, and Manny, Mancini said he would consider that. Reporting live in Wellington, Jacqueline Allen, 7 News.